Hi, I'm Perry Bokshane. Welcome to Common Sense. Get ready to let your imagination soar as we take a journey through Phenomenex, a company that is changing the future of science one element at a time. People are donating their blood to help save lives. But even though this may look like a philanthropic or charity event for the Red Cross, it's just part of a typical workday for employees at Phenomenex. Humanitarian events such as this blood drive are a core part of Phenomenex's business culture. The company, by definition, develops and manufactures scientific products. But President and CEO Fasha Major says what sets Phenomenex apart is the company's dedication to humanitarian work. We actually roll up our sleeves and we get uh, physically involved, uh, be it um, in, with education of uh, unprivileged children, uh, you know, working in hospitals, um, uh, attending to all um, horrific events, uh, disasters that may um, happen. We always volunteer. Uh, the company um, supports the, you know, anybody from the company who would want to go um, to um, uh, the disaster sites uh, to assist. Um, um, and um, this has become part and parcel um, uh, of um, a philosophy of the company. Since Phenomenex was founded in 1982, the corporate mission statement has remained constant to promote the growth, prosperity, and well-being of those they serve, including customers, employees, and humanity. The company is able to give back to community because of their sustained success as a global leader in the science industry. At their Torrance headquarters, scientists develop some of the most advanced analytical chemistry solutions. Phenomenex helps scientists around the world analyze and purify a variety variety of important chemicals, biochemical raw materials, intermediates, and finished products. Their products enable vital applications such as pharmaceutical safety, food quality, environmental purity, and crime scene testing, among many others. Chromatography is a process that allows our customers to take a sample containing a mixture of compounds that they're interested in analyzing and allowing that mixture to be separated into the individual components so that they can then accurately quantify or um, identify how much of each compound is present. Phenomenex's products allow their customers to test for the quantity of multiple compounds in a particular product. But there's multiple components that are there. One's there as a cough suppressant, one's there to maybe uh, reduce your headaches. There might be three or four active compounds that are present in that mixture. As a customer, we'd like to know that um, what we take is going to work. From our customer's perspective, um, who's manufacturing this product, they want to make sure that each of the compounds is present in the correct quantity so it has the right effectiveness and so their product will actually work. The HPLC column is one of Phenomenex's most popular measuring devices. The columns are used for products containing multiple compounds. Customers will introduce the sample, and each of the compounds will interact with the material that's inside the column differently. So over the course of time, you get a separation of these compounds. And so we get a picture, if you will, or what we call a chromatogram, mm -hmm. that allows our customers to determine how much of each compound is present and to identify which of those compounds is which. Phenomenex has assembled a science-based support team, Phenologix, which is dedicated to helping customers develop their methods and involve products that Phenomenex makes. This involves everything from gas chromatography to high-performance liquid chromatography. For example, we have uh, customers, a lot of customers from uh, the universities that are trying to develop new techniques for isolating and purifying certain compounds that they may think they have pharma, uh, pharmaceutical effects. And so they'll ask us for help in isolating a compound out of a very complex matrix. And what, um, what is uh, particularly exciting for you about, about 
being part of this group or what continually maybe surprises you? Well, uh, there's two aspects of that that's great. Number one is that uh, since we're able to work with so many different customers from all over the world and from different aspects of uh, society, whether it be law enforcement agencies to regulatory agencies, ph pharmaceutical companies, uh, every day we see new challenges and new projects. So the, the job is always something new. And so, you know, you work on a project, you, you come to a conclusion, and then, you know, the next day you're going to have uh, an all-new project to work on with uh, new challenges. Maintaining a competitive edge means investing in research and development. Phenomenex's science team is constantly developing the latest technology to stay at the top. One of their big breakthroughs came with Kinetics, a leap in column particle technology that changed industry standards by making compound separation more efficient. Well, kinetics is a new generation of particle that allows you to carry out uh, liquid chromatography separations at a higher speed and it's more cost effective to the analyst. It's simply a way of doing things more efficiently. But kinetics in particular has been a real game changer. Uh, it's a core shell product that uh, frankly is simply the best product on the market in terms of better chemistry, better, uh, better uh, separations for customers, but more importantly, it's got a really compelling uh, uh, value proposition for our customers. Breakthroughs such as Kinetics have enabled Phenomenex's customers to increase their productivity up to five times. We're going to take a short break, but when we come back, we'll show you how Phenomenex is bucking the economic recession and growing their business by scientific leaps and bounds. Welcome back to Common Sense. If you are just joining us, we are taking a behind-the-scenes look at Phenomenex, a company that develops and manufactures chromatography equipment for a broad range of industries. One of the key ways the company maintains their position as a global leader is by investing in research and development. And in technology, if, unless you are going forward, you are going backwards anyway. Um, uh, while at the present time we do, uh, have certainly the most uh, technologically advanced uh, products in the industry. Uh, our challenge is to continue developing uh, innovative products to make our customers' lives easier, better, faster, and, uh, and so on. Phenomenex relies on the strength of their unique business model to support their research and development endeavors. Finance directors say this is what allows them to continue to grow in a slow economy. While a lot of our competitors remain extremely cautious about the future and seem to be still sitting on the sidelines in terms of uh, making the investments to, to grow their businesses uh, in a substantial way, uh, we're taking exactly the opposite perspective. Uh, we are aggressively going after the market and looking at the opportunity to grow the business in double digits each year for the next five years. Their business model supports an international network of more than 550 employees in 64 different countries. Of those employees, about 350 work at their Torrance headquarters. The scope of Phenomenex's international presence can be challenging for a market that is constantly in a state of flux. Human resource managers say they step up to those challenges by creating a dynamic corporate environment that allows employees to adapt to changing conditions. Whether you're a salesperson, whether you're in marketing, whether you're in international sales, or you're in research and development, it's a matter of not just anticipating where that's going, but where, what are we going to do about it and how are we going to stay successful. So we have to prepare our people to do business in all of these different countries and in this highly competitive market. Additionally, Phenomenex capitalizes on the diversity of their internal talent. Corporate expansion has been successful because of the way Phenomenex brands their business culture. If you go to a Phenomenex office outside of the U.S., you know, basically, if you didn't know you were in a different country and you were standing in that office, you knew you were in Phenomenex by the way it looks, by the way we operate, by the language we use in terms of business language, how we do business, uh, the type of activities we do for our employees. 
Every aspect of the company is designed to integrate diversity into this international brand. Even the architecture of their corporate buildings nurture the Phenomenex brand. We're going to take a short break, but when we come back, we'll show you how creative environments nurture scientific innovation. Welcome back to Common Sense. If you're just joining us, we are taking a behind the scenes look at Phenomenex, a company that develops and manufactures chromatography equipment for a broad range of industries. Walking through the company's headquarters feels more like an international museum journey than a corporate tour. CEO Major credits his background as an architect for inspiring his passion to create positive workspaces. In this particular corridor is lovely. Um, if you, what did you have in mind, like even these spaces? And yeah, well, the spaces, it, um, one of the things I firmly believe, and it's been proven, uh, daylight and natural light are extraordinarily important in the working environment. You go to many offices that they are dark and morbid and just simply artificial and fluorescent light, which I don't believe in. Uh, there is not a place you can go to Phenomenex where uh, pe uh, people, staff working, regardless of where it is, including a warehouse, they generally have plenty of uh, natural light, uh, and I ideally uh, sunlight as much as we can. Uh, we can uh, there is an international theme throughout the offices that is also reflected by the diverse employee population. Foreign staff members say creating cross-cultural bridges is key to internal cooperation. The, the geography when you go into the office, wherever you might be, in New Zealand or in Australia, disappears. And uh, it's, I guess email makes it feel very close as well. And as far as the US goes, um, it's very similar, everything's instantaneous and we have a constant flow of people. Um, we try and make sure that you know, most of the staff get to the US somewhere along the line and experience the culture here, you know, the company culture, not so much the American culture, but the, you know, the special Phenomenex culture. Phenomenex nurtures this company culture by encouraging employees to participate in philanthropic projects. One of the things that I'm always excited about actually is uh, just the sheer fact that we, we try to have a, a, a group meeting with uh, employees, so anybody who wants to come and give new ideas for what we want to get involved with next year. And so I'm really looking forward to creative ideas that are going to come up because every year it changes for us. It's, it's not something that we just typically do something and, and expect it to happen. It's, it's a dynamic and fluid group, so if employees think that you know, there's a specific uh, area of expertise that we, we should be looking at or a, a specific endeavor, then we can go do it. One of the philanthropy group's most recent projects was for Feed My Starving Children. Employees packed more than 130,000 meals and sponsored the on-site volunteer event for people in need. We came across this organization called Feed My Starving Children and their method of serving is really unique. It fits in perfectly with our philanthropy group because they actually allow you to get your hands dirty, uh, be involved in packing meals that are going to be shipped out to kids all over the country, all over the world actually. So this is a really great event for us to be able to have on site, invite a lot of people right on, on site at Phenomenex to be able to touch the lives of people all over the world. The philanthropy group impacts the Torrance community as well as international communities. One unit of blood, one blood donation can save up to three lives. And so if um, typically uh, the Phenomenex organizes blood drives, uh, which amount to about 75 pints or 75 units per year, so it saves up to 200, 220 lives, uh, which is phenomenal. Taking part in life-saving events gives employees a sense of collective family. I think different in the things we set up so people feel like this is a family, they feel like this is a place they want to you know, devote their life to and, and grow throughout their, you know, existence as a, a, a worker or employee, you know, at the end of the day, people are going to have to work so they can provide their families. So we want the environment here to be as enjoyable as possible because the more fun people have, the more they want to work. Phenomenex employees go the extra mile on certain days to make breakfast for staff that arrives for the early work shift. Typically, a group of us gets here around 4 a.m. to set up so that the first shift that comes in at 6 o'clock has breakfast before they go into work. That's spirit. <laughs> that, is, that is spirit, and uh, that's kind of typical of Phenomenex and uh, lots of our employees. Uh, 
they you know, go the extra mile to make sure we have a good uh, work environment. Creating this kind of work environment could be one of the biggest reasons Major was named a 2010 Ernst Young Entrepreneur of the Year finalist. So many of my uh, colleagues always talk uh, about uh, our involvement and how important and how they find the company uh, unique and perhaps it's sometimes for some people it's even more important than the job itself. And I'm very proud of it, I, I love it and uh, that part we are not going to let go. From science to community to international partnerships, Phenomenex sets a humanitarian standard that is inspiring for people with the shared spirit of giving back. I'm Perrin Bakshay and thank you so much for joining us here on Common Sense. Here's to imagining a better future for us all.